Hello everybody, this is week number 8 and it goes from June 1st to June 5th and the year is the 2020. Our objective is to recognize vocabulary related to health and diseases in different listening exercises. Okay, we are going to start with the Shaping My Language book. So I invite you to go to this book to the page 55, page 55 exercise one in the exercise one you have to find the words that best complete this text okay this is an email and you have to use one word to complete each gap okay one gap is this blank the space in blank this is one gap so you have to complete uh, this email with different with one word for each gap to give coherence to the text, to the email, okay? On the second exercise, uh, we have an email and we have to answer to it. On the left, we have the email and on the right, we have to write an answer to this email. Hey friend, I heard about the flu epidemic in your city. Are you okay? Be very careful. Flu is contagious, very contagious. Do you have a good doctor to visit? How can you protect yourself from getting sick? Let me know as soon as possible. So, uh, on this page you have to give an answer to these questions. Look, are you okay? Do you have a good doctor to visit? How can you protect yourself from getting sick? These are three questions we have to answer in uh, this space on the right. On the In the exercise three, it says, work with a classmate and choose a role. Ask and answer questions using the prompts and the information card. Okay, so we have different WH questions. What, who, when, where, what, and uh, where. Okay, so we have different information. We have pieces of information here. And we have to ask questions. You can formulate questions with the words. For example, what uh, will we wear? Who will help? And the answers are on the left. We have to wear, we will wear, wear comfortable clothes and shoes. Uh, volunteers will help. The answers are on the left. And you have to formulate questions with the words on the right. On the page 56, you just have to write the new words. Yes, the new words uh, that you are learning, remember to use drawings, meanings, synonyms to help you remember, but don't use uh, Spanish, zero Spanish. So on this page, you have to include the new words that you are learning this week. And on the page 57, we have a listening exercise, okay, with five, with five different uh, points yes and this is multiple choice so you have to underline the best answer it says friends talking health okay this is a test test friends talking health so I will give you the audio the audio track in the platform so you just play it and then choose a B or C according to what you hear, according to what you hear, okay? So this is it, this is all for this week. Thank you very much for your attention. See you next time. Bye-bye.